want to play hoops, but you're on a hillside. How do you deal with it? Well, that was the situation on this particular project. So what we had to do was we had to come in and build a couple of retaining walls. We came in and cut into the hillside up here uh, and built a retaining wall. And then we had to build a retaining wall over here as well. And so between the two, we were able to create a flat spot on the hillside so we could play basketball, which, you know, this is a very nice sized basketball court. Yeah. Oh, and we even make it. I mean, what a great place to play. Uh, so, you know, in, on a hillside, it is possible to build things like basketball courts. The other thing over here, we did, had to do the same exact situation uh, for the play area. We had to build a retaining wall uh, to support the hill. We had to build a retaining wall to support the fill dirt that we had to put on the other side so we could create a flat spot for the play area. Because who wants to go off the slide and roll down the hill? Well, that, that, that could be kind of fun. But anyway, hillsides uh, and creating areas other than swimming pools. Pools have to be flat, but so do basketball courts and so do play areas. And so this was the solution on this particular project. On the uphill side of the project, we came in and built these features. And then on the downhill side, we came and built the pool up by the house, uh, which we had to have some retaining for that as well, which will feature this in another video coming soon to you. So this is Mike Farley, and I'm in Alito, Texas tonight. Hope you guys are having a great evening. Uh, after scoring two points like that, I'm going to have to go get a steak or something. So uh, maybe I can do it again. I doubt it, but we'll see. So you all have a good one.